beautiful eyes. That's Bruno. I'm sorry, I became <laughs> distracted by Bruno. This is Bruno, Monica Schmidt from the Houston Humane Society. What do we think Bruno is? Bruno is very pretty. Look at these beautiful eyes. We have Bruno listed as a dachshund mixed with a little rat terrier. There may be some chihuahua in there. Because mm -hmm, he's shaking like a chihuahua. He does. He, he kind of shakes like a little chihuahua, but he loves to be held. Oh, we could tell that he was, he Total was lap dog. crying a little bit. So, so as soon as we put him in your lap, he yes. just said, oh. Home yes. with Monica once again. When you're ready for oh, a lap dog, finally. Bruno's your boy. Yeah. So, and about, um, you say four months? Four months. He might yeah. get a little bit bigger, but he's, he's definitely going to be a small dog. So if you're oh. looking for a little house dog, a little lap dog to maybe watch Channel 2 News with, that's right. That's right. Bruno's your boy. And we talk about being able to get these dogs out and get them exercise. Mm -hmm. And it's more than, okay, you got a yard. They really need right. more than just letting out in the yard a little bit. They do, absolutely. And it really curbs a lot of behaviors that we see returns or even owner surrenders for, such as chewing or being destructive. If you can get them some of that exercise, it kind of wears them out. They're too right. tired to chew on things. So one of the first things you want to do is make sure you have some great training, basic skills in place. That includes walking well on a leash, but also a really good come when called in case the dog does get away from mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. um, invest in some professional training if maybe it's your first dog or if maybe it's a really hyper or um, different personality than what you're dealing used to dealing with. Um, but also always make sure you include collars and tags and an up-to-date microchip in case they do get loose from you. How soon can you get the microchipping done? Is that it? Um, we do it as soon as they get adopted. Okay. So we're doing it as early as eight weeks. Okay. Um, they do make a mini microchip that's like half the size of a grain of rice right. and then the normal one a grain of rice. So it's pretty easy. Um, get in the habit of carrying water with you. They make little doggy travel bowls that'll clip to your leash. Um, it gets so hot here in Houston and yeah. you want to keep your pet hydrated. But yeah. um, I can't stress this enough, dawn and dusk. Those are the best times to walk your pet because it does get so hot and the concrete or asphalt that you're walking on is going to be 20, 30, 40 degrees hotter. Um, than it is outside. Well, Bruno's ready to go. You can tell. He's crying for you to go <laughs> pick him up. So get on out there. Houston Humane Society is open every day. They're open today as well. 14700 Alameda Road, 713-433-6421. And by the way, you can see animals in need. You can check out our adopt a pet section on click to Houston.com. It's under the consumer tab. So, Bruno, we hope you get a home today, huh? Yeah, he's so cute.